there are definitely research areas in 6G which are currently not addressed by the, the 5G or 5G and beyond standard. The colleagues are working on higher frequency coverage, D-band, sub-terahertz communication, and not only communication but also channel sounding, sensing applications, that's where we are going, reaching uh, gradually and step by step into higher frequencies, and higher frequencies offer the opportunity to cover wider bandwidths, an area where we are also active already. We want to bring, you know, lab laboratory discoveries, new physics to, towards technology uh, that can benefit society. I would first say that you call it the universal internet, you know, for this IoT type of devices. I think it's the next generation of mobile broadband. And then I would call it uh, these um, <coughs> um, reliable real-time communication, uh, where then all those XR, VR, AR type of devices will be in. How can we make sure that we're getting low latency communication? The best way to have low latency is be able to transmit and receive whenever you want. So technologies like full duplex that enable that interference cancellation with intelligent beam forming, with intelligent processing and scheduling, those go hand in hand to make sure that the air interface can evolve into new sensing applications into that RF understanding. And also we have been looking at the technologies like RIS, which includes you know, reconfigurable intelligent surface uh, that also allow us to manipulate the propagation of RF signals and so on. In Germany, if I consider the big initiatives, the big projects, uh, 6G hubs, uh, where different university partners, uh, research institutes work together to realize a technology base uh, for future 6G systems. This is the best uh, research program on 6G in the world. It can't be done alone. Um, that needs to be done um, in collaboration. And um, that needs research projects, that needs interaction with customers uh, on a one-on-one -on -one level, on a uh, three-party, four-party level. Depends, of course, always on the situation. Uh, but we can't do it alone. We can only do it together.